Beyonza Duran, you know there's nothing more wonderful than a happy child. This is Ella, and she's very happy. I think she's actually a little sleepy right now. But there's nothing more miserable than a complaining child, somebody that's just griping. My husband uh, always laughs and he says, Beyonza, griping is a Southern term. Well, I don't know if it's griping or complaining at your house, but it's all the same. We don't want it. You know, when I wrote the song, Sorry, I'm Allergic to Griping, I had no idea that it would become one of the most important songs we had ever seen in our home. We sang it again and again, because complaining is just contagious. Complaining is a part of, I think, human nature. It's just something that seems so natural at times. That's why we have to elevate it uh, in our home, the awareness of griping, how that that's not our choice. Not only is complaining a part of human nature at times, I think it's a part of our culture. You know, it seems like that people just, uh, they, they just complain about things. It seems like we've become experts at being critical and being unhappy. And uh, one of the most important things we can do is declare our homes as a gripe-free zone. In fact, uh, uh, when I wrote this song, I, I didn't realize that when we declared our home to be a gripe-free zone, that we would talk about it so much. When we come in from school, the kids, sometimes they could just take off on a negative vein. That they could just tell me all the things that didn't happen right uh, that day. And I remember so many times saying, hey, wait a minute, guys. I want to hear the good stuff. I want to hear the fun stuff. Because you see, our children's personalities are formed in their childhood. And if we allow our children to just complain all the time, and they grow up to be adults that complain, then really we've missed a great opportunity because I believe that kids want to have fun. I believe they want to. Uh, have a happy home. And so uh, if I thought of a strategy for complaining, it would be one word, regrouping. Because it seems like every day uh, I'd have to get a new strategy. I'd have to regroup and I'd have to have a new beginning. And that's okay. Complaining is an area that it just um, doesn't go away. But when you begin to create a culture of gratitude, of happy, then your children really begin to um, enjoy finding the good things that happened that day. I remember asking so many times, hey guys, what's the most fun thing that happened to you today? And they would just come up with these things, or guys, what was the funniest thing that you did today? And they'd tell me stories and we would laugh. Well, parents, you can, redirect the conversations in your home. And that's a strategy because it's refocusing the very thing that your kids talk about. Keep it real, keep it fun, never give up, and understand that your children really can become best buddies. Your home really can become a gripe-free zone. And you really can have days filled with laughter and fun and love honoring one another. You know, I'd love to hear from you. If you would uh, maybe like to comment or maybe you even have a couple of questions you like to ask me. I'd love to talk with you about things that you want to talk about. But most of all, I want you to know that I really believe that uh, your home can be all that you wanted it to be. Don't give up. Don't give up on yourself. Don't give up on your kids. Let's talk some more next time. Can you say bye? Bye-bye. <laughs> no, 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 so sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm itching. I'm scratching. Please stop because.